Hey, what's going on everybody? Today we have a video about some new equipment which is listed on our website. So feel free to uh, have a look and if you have any questions, feel free to ask in the comment or write us directly. So let's start. Firstly, we have pretty small interesting units which we created by ideas of our buyers. This is a unit for controlling the liquid temperature out of your steel, in your steel. Uh, you can control temperature of wort, beer, anything you like. You can install it on atmospheric tube and track the temperature uh, in case if the column is not working well. So you can find a lot of things and stuff where you can install this stuff. And also we can change the connections instead of 10 millimeter tubes. Yeah, we can install half inch thread, quarter inch or something different. So I got so many equipment on the table. Then we created plates for continuous distilling column, actually for three inch continuous uh, column. And it's made from copper and it's made from stainless steel. So uh, I will move the sound. God damn loud. Anyway, you can see that it is made from copper and one one and a half millimeter so it's pretty thick and pretty durable and it can be installed in our three inch extension pipe because we have a special edge where you can install our plates or plates like they saw i mean copper plates uh, couple cu copper bubble plates yeah, or these place for continuous distilling column. We can make them for uh, usual three inch extensions in case if you don't have our extensions, it is possible, but only for half uh, of meter, so 500 millimeter long. Uh, otherwise it will be easier to bend during the shipping. And yeah, then we have a feeding unit for three inch continuous still. Yeah, so it's a pretty basic equipment, nothing too crazy about it. And the unit which I already show in this video episode, this is a siphon unit for collecting spent, spent mesh. Yeah, so you band comes like this. It has a universal thermometer port where you can install automatic uh, digital thermometer or anything. On the end we have installed 10 millimeter tube so you can install here uh, water from your condenser so you can mix hot water with a really hot uh, spent mesh which is 100 degrees Celsius so you won't have a really high temperature which is going uh, on the floor or in the buckets, uh, you can have a look at the video in that corner if you're interested in continuous distilling process. And also for micro distilling companies, we have made three inch Soxlet extractor. <laughs> yeah, it's got them pretty big equipment. Uh, give me a sec. One of our customers from Philippines asked us to make this and another one is already made for Croatia. Uh, there are some people are making something with CBD. So uh, this kind of equipment is interested for people who are working with botanicals. And of course, it's not like <laughs> home brewing equipment. Of course not. This is too big for home brewers. But in case if you are working with botanicals and you need process of using Soxlet extractor, Yep, here it comes and if you like to see how it works, there's also a link uh, over there. Uh, if I won't probably turn this thing on because the process is absolutely the same one as on 2 inch unit. So feel free to watch it if you like. Uh, it's a just bigger version and you're just able to put a lot of botanical, botanicals in this bunker and make extraction <laughs> as you wish. And in the end of this video, I have pretty cool little news that false boil is now available again on our website. So with this stuff, you're able to increase the working volume of your boiler. So 
it has to be our prime boiler 25 40 or 50 liter you simply can install it on the top of your boiler and use a special lock which comes with this stuff and a special gasket which which is also comes with this unit you change the gasket which is right here uh, instead of uh, the regular one on the false boiler because this one is thicker and it's very important and one side of the false boiler is also thicker and we've changed some stuff in this unit and we've created a new lock so right now it's really easy to install it on a boiler it won't leak and you can increase uh, volume which is needed to be for example you have 50 liter mesh and you have 25 liter boiler Yep, that's it for today. That's a short video about some new stuff on our website. In case if you like to see anything else, feel free to write in the comments or write us directly. We'd be glad to answer and help. Thank you for watching. Happy distilling.